All right, change of plan. Treadmill wasn't working. So me and my boys, <laughs> as you can see, we're going walking. Um, yeah, just burning some calories. You know how it is. Hey, lads. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Oh! No Makona heft beer, mmm. Only instant coffee this morning. Well, that's fucking shit. <laughs> Looks like it's Nescafe, Blend 43. strong. Now I don't even need this shit this morning. I'm feeling really good. Feeling excited. And if you hadn't guessed, that is because tomorrow I'm officially going to become a landlord for the first time. So that is extremely exciting. It's, uh, it's Tuesday morning. I got back to Alice Springs eight days ago now um, on Monday last week and since then <laughs> I haven't had a day off so today is officially my eighth day in a row and I've still got two more after this so all up I'll be smashing ten days work in a row before I even get a day off but it doesn't bother me because I've got this this purpose and this vision about what I actually need to earn money for. So, you know, earning money now is not for me, it's basically for a business, a real estate business. So, you know, that, that basically makes, it makes hustling and working long hours and, and not having too much time off um, easier. And it gives me reason to do that. So, yeah, it's not an issue at all. You know, some days are pretty cruisy, so you will get through some days and you'll get home after work and you, you won't be tired and you'll feel like, fuck, that was, a, that was a really good sort of cruisy day. Not an easy day, but a cruisy day. So you come home and you're not stressed and you're not, you're not emotionally drained and you're not tired, but some days you certainly are. Um, and that's just, that's just what you get with this kind of job, I guess. Um, you never know what you're gonna get, so. This morning, uh, I heard from my co-workers that my client was still up at about four in the morning. So what that means for me is that he's gonna stay in bed till about 12 midday, I hope. And, um, and that means that we've got some spare time. So what I'm gonna do with my spare time, seeing as it is quarter to seven in the morning, and I'm feeling inspired and feeling motivated like I do usually first thing in the morning that is the time that I like to smash out things that I need to do um, I like to just crack into jobs that I need to do I like to crack into fasted cardio first thing in the morning I like to do things um, first thing in the morning it's just when I like to do it except I'm never up first thing in the morning <laughs> or if I am I'm at work so basically I'm going to combine everything, kill two birds with one stone, I'm going to go inside and use our client's treadmill. Um, now they are overweight, I'll say that, and um, it's not through lack of us trying to keep them on a diet, um, you know, they just can't lose weight. I think they may have some sort of metabolic damage, I, I don't know, but um, oh look. These guys want to say hello. Hello. Oi. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> uh, so anyway, I'm going to go inside, use the treadmill, the client's treadmill, for about an hour, chuck on the news, and um, hopefully by 8 o'clock this morning, I'll have had three, 350 calories cardio under the books in the books, 
under the belt. Uh, and then we can continue on with the day. Looking forward to tomorrow for settlement day on this property, which I can't wait for. I'm stoked. Um, it's turning out that settlement is happening on the 27th. So rental payments come in at the end of each month. So I've already organized that, got all the you know, bank account details and stuff uh, with the property manager, everything like that. So it's actually really good. The, these, fir these first three days at the end of this month, um, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th of April, I will be getting paid rent for, and that will come through probably on the, the second or third. And then the next time I get paid any rent will be at the end of next month, so at the end of May. All right, change of plan. Treadmill wasn't working. So me and my boys, <laughs> as you can see, we're going walking. Um, yeah, just burning some calories. You know how it is. Hey, lads. What's that? Fuck, you're not even scared, are you? No wonder you can pick up chickens so easy. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Now, I don't know about you guys, but... I think it's safe to say that this guy is having some fun. That'd be pretty sweet. It's coming down. You know, sometimes I'm looking around and I just cannot get over how perfect blue the sky is. It's just insane. There is literally not one speck of white in the sky. Not one cloud, nothing. It's amazing. But all you can see is the moon. I don't know if you can see it, but the moon's up there. And it's insane. I love it. Love it. Especially coming into winter now. We've, we've all braved, braved the summer, braved another summer and it's coming into winter so nice crisp fresh mornings up to about 27 28 degrees and beautiful just the way i like it <sighs> all right guys cardio done eight o'clock on the dot We've done 6,100 steps. My heart rate is at 80, so it was definitely low intensity, steady state, but that's all right. And uh, calories, well, it tells me the total from 12 o'clock midnight, and it's at 1,088. So, I probably, fuck, probably burnt about 250 just then. Nice brisk walk, 6,000 steps. Great start to the day, and uh, exciting things to come, so I will keep you guys posted, and uh, I'll better go inside to see if this guy's awake, guarantee he's not though, but anyways, peace, have a great day, see you guys later. Stranded, reaching out.